Now we'll go downstairs and look at one other thing we can do inside the home and that's changing the furnace filter. What this home has is just your typical uh, standard high efficiency propane furnace and to get at the air filter fortunately we don't, uh, we don't have to take off the front of the furnace or anything like that. The reason you want to keep your filters clean is to ensure the most efficient delivery of heat to the living space as possible. When this filter gets dirty, it gets plugged up, the furnace has to run longer to force more air through the system into your living spaces. So what we're going to do today is change this dirty filter and replace it with a new one. This just happens to be the filter on the filter type you're going to see for this heating system. Not every filter is going to look like this. You want to take a look at what you have first and then match it up at a home improvement store with the one that you need. One thing to keep in mind, there's going to be a little arrow on these pointing, uh, pointing at the direction of the airflow in the system. And the way to look at where the air is flowing, usually the furnace is here with the heat. Above it, there's going to be the area called the plenum. The plenum is just your main duct. There's supply ducts branching off and going up to different rooms in this home. So the airflow is moving up. We want the arrow to match that. We'll just take this access door off to get at the old filter. I don't know what kind of shape this one's in. I think it was changed about six months ago. And maybe we can see the difference between the two. You can see a difference in coloration, I think. One's a little bit showing that age a little bit, I guess. Airflow up. New filter goes in. And that's done.